both are continuous so if the both variable are continuous in that case the estimation will not work so one question is possible from this correlation very important topic so if both are quantitative in that case we are interested to see the pattern if one is increasing another variable is increasing or decreasing okay this is called correlation and we use the scatter plot for this purpose scatter plot okay so on x axis one variable y axis one variable both are quantitative variable so for each x value there is certain y value so there is a dots on that x y axis okay and that is called your scatter plot and if if the value means if the one x axis is increasing y axis is increasing then that is called the positive correlation i forget to put the graph for that okay let me show you so is this graph is visible in my paper yes or no any can anyone can say okay yes sir okay so see this is the x axis this is the y axis and if the the dots are like this is going up so it's positive correlation x increasing y increasing okay this way if it is opposite like dots are this way negative correlation x is increasing y is decreasing the lower one okay so depending on this means x one value is increasing like bmi is increasing uh hemoglobin is increasing or decreasing so if hemoglobin is increasing it's on x y axis its graph is like this okay dot 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 this way if decreasing then the dots are like this this way okay dot 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 this way so positive correlation means one variable is increasing another variable value is also increasing negative correlation is one variable is increasing another variable is decreasing so if positive correlation the value is more than zero okay if negative correlation the value is less than zero but always remember the range correlation lies from plus 1 to minus 1 that's all and if it is zero it means that there is no linear relationship so variables are independent linearly because correlation only provide the information about the linear relationship okay so if the option is variable or independent and the option is variable are not linearly related you choose the second option variables are not linearly related okay and maximum so if you will they will ask what is the range for the correlation plus 1 to minus 1 okay if if it is plus 1 positive correlation means positive positive then positive correlation negative then negative correlation negative correlation means one value increase second value is decrease positive correlation one value increase second value is increase so this is very important topic maybe they will ask they will put some scenario and then ask some options on that or they will ask simply the range or they will ask what if the correlation is zero okay